Hey, Dr. Berg here. Now, in this video, we're going to show you how to relieve menstrual discomfort. Okay, and you mentioned you have some of that, right? Mm -hmm. So, um, I think you said you had a problem even like um, ovulation and not the actual um, event, mm -hmm. <laughs> menstrual bleeding. So, you have a 28 day cycle. Every month, a female goes through this trauma where she's releasing an egg from the ovary. It goes through a little tube called the fallopian tube into the uterus to become fertilized, and, and, she, and it bleeds. And it, if there's no sperm, obviously it's not going to get fertilized, but it's just going to bleed and slough off. So you have a lot of hormone changes. You have a lot of extra um, uh, cramping and bleeding and all sorts of things. So that is a trauma. We're going to show you how to uh, relieve that, and this procedure I believe every single female needs to do. Now the problem is this one you're going to need a little help. You're going to need one more person. So I'm going to do it on her. But typically um, you can't really do it on yourself. Um, but it would be actually impossible to do it on yourself. But if you can get someone to help you do this, it'll be a great relief. And so um, again, I'm not making any claims that we're curing fibroids ovarian cyst, polycystic ovarian syndrome, endometriosis, fibrocystic breast um, infertility. I'm not making those claims, but I am telling you that um, if you have those problems, you should probably do this technique in addition to smoothing, make your cycle really smooth, okay? Now, here's how we're going to do it. Um, the ovaries are located, the uterus is located right here, and the ovaries are about an inch to the left and to the right. Now what she's going to do is she's going to make a fist with the right hand. Now how does this work? Basically we're increasing communication through the body by using the body to increase communication. So the, on the Chinese medicine, the positive part of the hand is the, is the positive. The, this side of the hand is the positive. The back side is the negative. What does that mean? It means when you, when you actually treat someone using the back part of the hand, you get deeper because it's, it's a negative charge. This is superficial. Now, you don't need to know that. All you need to know is we're going to go deep. We're going to make this a fist, then she's going to hold it over her right ovary. It's going to be right there. Okay? So that's, that's step one. While she's holding it there, we're going to be stimulating some acupressure points on her back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have you just, um, I guess you can, um, can you flip around? Yep. Now she, you get, okay, just flip around there and you're going to hold, hold that fist right on that right over it. Good. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this device. You see there's three different sizes. There's a wide one, there's a medium, and a skinny one. We're going to take the medium one here and we're going to um, just do this on her back. We're going to rub down. See her spines right through here? We're just going to rub down her back like this 20 times. Three, four, five. Now, why are we rubbing down on the back? In Chinese medicine, this is called the bladder meridian. But it doesn't necessarily have to do with the bladder. It has to do with um, a, a channel that goes through all 12 meridians, which means that when we do this, we're stimulating, um, almost resetting her body's computer to allow wherever she has her hand to be uh, corrected. So she, we're working on the right ovary right now, and we're working through the meridian system, which are kind of a nerve channel circuitry. Okay. So that's what you would have someone do on your back. Okay, so we just did the right ovary. Now we're going to do the left ovary. Just put, put your fist on the opposite side right there. Good. Now make sure that the other hand, the palm is up and just rest it. So wherever, I don't want her hand touching anything because I want all focus on her left ovary. And we're going to do this 20 times. Now. We're actually doing more than just working on the meridian because in the back you have these nerve channels and they're about an inch to the left and the right of the spine and these nerve channels control and coordinate 
a whole bunch of things in the body. So we're stimulating the meridians and the nerve channels. Twenty times. Okay. Now, um, let's have you swing around, face this way. So we did the left and right over, but we have to do the uterus. So I need to show you where that's located. It's right in the center, so it's below the belly button, right there in the center, right there. Okay, now sw swing around. Right in the center. Okay, so we're just going to go down the back 20 times. Now the uterus, that is taking a lot of trauma on, on females, so you want to do this every single day for probably about six to eight weeks. And the reason why you're doing this, and it's really quick, I mean, you're just gonna go through this procedure. It might take you four minutes, but if you do this, her cycle will be better and better and better and better. Less pain. Also, if you have a person that has menstrual problems and do this, it'll turn off the pain almost immediately and the cramping. Okay, so that would be the procedure for the ovary and the uterus.